I'm a stay so tribe spiritual healer back to give you guys a message. This message is from my air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Thank you so much for watching this video. Love you guys so much. Hope you guys are well and safe. Okay, my beautiful uh, air signs. I got some channel messages in my notebook. And I heard the song by Rihanna when I was connecting in your, to your energy. I heard the song by Rihanna. That bitch better have my money. Pay me what you owe me. Like, blank, blank, blank. Okay, so somebody owes you money or somebody needs to pay you what they owe you. Somebody took money, borrowed money, or um, tried to steal money or scam money because I heard scammers or hackers. But um, something could have, some money could have been withdrawn out of your accounts. And then you don't know what, what, where this came from, okay? And you could be contacting your bank or your credit card company and letting them know you better pay me back my money. Somebody um, here, it could be tapping into your accounts, hacking your device here or scamming you for something. Someone charged you something and you didn't receive your merchandise, your product, or someone charged you something and you didn't even order that, or that wasn't you, someone scammed you, okay? So that's what I'm hearing. That bitch better have my money, okay? So I feel like you guys are gonna get this money back or you guys are gonna get this money back paid into your account, or it's gonna be deposited back into your account or somebody's gonna have to pay you back in full, okay? There's a decision being made, something was being investigated, Okay, I also heard that somebody here has like a bisexual secret or gay around you. Somebody around your energy has a bisexual secret and they're getting exposed. Someone's clashing someone else on video or sleeping with someone of the same sex. Somebody could be keeping over this over someone's head or showing other people this video or telling other people about this. And people are finding out, people are talking about this. Okay, this person that was sleeping with multiple people that was like a fake friend to you or that was supposed to be a friend or this is your ex okay this person is sleeping with multiple people somebody has a dark entity entity attachment there's a sudden tower here because somebody passed away but this death was suspicious somebody was poisoned and someone made it look like it was an accident or someone had like a overdose but somebody was poisoned unexpected pregnancy could be coming up for someone watching this video or somebody around you air signs there's a karmic female spying on you. This was a fake friend or someone you dealt with before, okay? This person is spying on you because, you know, this person broke their, your trust. This person deceived you. This person could have brought you some sort of conflict. This person could have got you involved in some sort of drama by gossiping or making something up on you or just very um, en envious or this person lied to you when you found out. You, you could have cut this person out of your life. This person is literally spying on you because this karmic has no more friends because she got exposed lying on you. And this could be a male or female, right? But there's somebody here that's a hacker and that's a scammer that's getting caught up. Okay, the, the names that I heard while I was channeling your messages. I heard Carmen. I heard Andy. I heard Carol. I heard Caroline. I heard Janessa. I heard Steve or Steven. I heard Terry. I heard Tanisha. I heard Lonnie, Lonnie or Dawn, I heard Danny, okay, or Daniel, so I'm going to get into the messages here, a couple energy oracle messages, spirit guides and angels speak to me clearly, for my beautiful air signs watching this video, what's the message, thank you spirit, and this message could be for you, somebody that's around your energy, okay, somebody that you're dealing with, this could be for you or the cross watcher, someone else, okay? So take the messages that resonates and leave the rest. Okay, let's get it. I feel like somebody's confused or they're like under some sort of confusion spell. Someone's doing confusion spells on someone here. Someone's confused, okay, about where their life is heading or they're confused about... um. Somebody's confused about a child or uh, who this child's father is, someone that was connected to you. There's the angel of balance here to balance you out. There's an angel of balance coming in your energy. Someone could be 48, okay? But the angel of balance is basically balancing your energy, okay? Um, detaching from other people, reaping your benefits of your rewards from detaching from these jealous fake enemies or frenemies. Okay, yeah, victory is yours. You're having some sort of victory here. Someone could be 28. Victory because you chose to walk away and love yourself first. Someone's trying to unbalance your energy with the yin-yang in reverse. Somebody could be 22 years old. Somebody could be 28. 
Okay, the angel of balance is here to balance you out because there's someone that doesn't want you to have a victory, someone that's jealous of that, you know, you're in this peaceful energy or you're becoming successful, thinking about a business or just making better decisions right now for yourself. And someone's not in balance, their energy is off. And when this person comes around you or they came around you, you started, you kind of got headaches. Somebody, if somebody gives you headaches or makes you feel nauseous, if you're feeling nauseous a lot, it's because somebody has a dark entity attachment and, and, and basically like, like when they come around you you start getting nervous you start feeling unbalanced cut this person out of your energy angel of love is in reverse yeah you feel like you're like somebody here feels like they're blocked off to love with you because you won't turn back and you won't take them back in your life or somebody's blocked off on love because they wanted to block you off from love and somebody's making you feel like, you know, they're not appreciating you. You feel like everybody left you or people abandon you all the time. And you're, you're just doing the most for these people. And um, they're taking love from you, but they're not giving it back in return. Walk away. Somebody could be 49 years old. Wow. Yeah, somebody's all tied up now in a situation because when they came for you, they plotted against you, 23. This person plotted against you, came for you, tried to get you involved in conflict, lied on you. This person could be all tied up. This person could be facing the justice system for something that's coming up. Or um, literally somebody wanted to have you all tied up and confused. You know, somebody could have been ha paid someone to come and harm you. Or somebody could have went to the extreme and teamed up with all the karmics in your community. You know, they wanted to um, jump you, fight you, tie you up, do this with spell work. Whether they did this energetically, this person has an attachment. They want to keep you all tied up in, in drama, chaos, or conflict, but you releasing yourself. Or you already did. Okay, a lot of you guys are intuitive. Psychic empaths, goddess energy, mystic energy here, male or female, the garden and the gate. Yeah, this energy attachment has been stuck on someone since they were a child, or this energy attachment was sent to you as a child. Something could have happened to someone as a child that was very traumatic here, you know, at the age of five years old or seven, okay? But there's like something that's going on with the child. Like I said, somebody has this dark sexual secret. Somebody could be touching or harming a child, or this is just like something that happened to you guys as a child, really traumatized you here. Okay, maybe this happened to you as a child. A family member could have tried touching you or a, fa a father or mother figure could have caused some sort of conflict or trauma into your life, right? Someone has been trying to strategically plan on how to get you all tied up and it's not working. This has backfired on somebody because they couldn't get you all tied up because you found out the truth and you blocked this person or you walked away. You guys could have moved away or you could be thinking about moving. You're about to relocate soon. Somebody that's 53 years old could be a mother figure or could be someone in your family, a mother or aunt, okay? Magician in the mirror is like somebody's projecting. Somebody's doing mirror spells. Somebody wants to switch destinies with you. Somebody wants you to have these bad thoughts about yourself, okay? Somebody could have been doing beauty spells to mess with your health, to mess with your weight, okay? Maybe you gain weight suddenly and you can't lose it. Or maybe you lost weight suddenly and you can't gain weight. Whether you're losing weight or gaining weight or something's going on with your self-esteem, somebody's doing that through their mirror spells. Wow. So block that energy. Clean your mirrors with, with Florida water. Take your spiritual bath. Florida water and rose petals. Cleanse your energy and um, remove the beauty spells or the mirror spells. You can also do a coconut cleanse on your crown chakra. Okay, third chakra archangel Shamiel is like basically your solar plexus energy. 37 years old, somebody could be. Somebody could be 21 or like I said, 53 here. Third chakra archangel Shamiel is clearing out your solar plexus chakra. Somebody didn't want you to be confident in yourself. Somebody wanted you to be doubting yourself. Something could have happened as a child and it really kept you in this energy throughout your life. You didn't take risks. Maybe you were not a risk taker. Maybe you're getting out that energy and you're stepping into your power, taking leaps of faith now because you're clearing out your solar plexus, which is basically like your intuition and your creativity, right? And for a woman, that's basically where you create a child, your womb. Somebody could have been doing womb magic, womb spells to try to block your fertility for someone watching. But you, um, someone here is going to get an unexpected positive pregnancy test. Someone was been trying to get pregnant and somebody was blocking that, but that blockage has been removed. Your ancestors are granting your wish and this is a specific message for someone watching, not for everyone. If you've been trying to have a child, your ancestors will be granting you your wish. Okay, so yeah. 
um, the blockages have been removed. The angels are literally pouring into your cup, okay? They're balancing you out. Something's coming into fruition, and you put an end to something. The death card in reverse, someone wants to resurrect the situation because you walked away, because you found out this person was wearing a false mask. You could have been dealing with another air sign. You could have been dealing with another air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Or you also could have been dealing with um, a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But at the end of the day, you like bossed up, right? You're the empress here. Male or female, empress energy, creating something new, birthing something new. Someone's definitely finding out they're pregnant, though. It could be you or someone else you're around or connected to, someone in your energy, right? And then there's this King of Cups in reverse, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. This could be someone in your life. This could be a father figure. This could be an ex, but this is someone, a fake friend. But this is someone that didn't want you to step into this power that you're in now. And this is someone that was trying to break up a connection for you with someone that you were meant to be with. This person could have been doing womb magic, separation spells, because they were scorned and bitter. Because you figured out this person didn't love you or value you, so you took back your power, Okay. Someone really put three swords in your heart, this king of cups. Could be, like I said, father figure energy, or like I said before, someone that um you cut off that you were dealing with. Friend or lover or ex or father figure in your life here. Yeah, working with someone um else, getting readings, doing spell work is all backfiring. In reverse, you have awakened to your 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 spiritual energy or your powers or your gifts. And that shit is backfiring. You're fighting back spiritually. Maybe you lit a reversal candle, maybe you did some sort of Energy cleanse or maybe something over the full moon has backfired. Okay, now this energy right here, this King of Cups is holding on to these burdens now. That they wanted to cause you burdens, now they're holding on to burdens. Aries Leo Sag energy, the chariot in reverse. Someone's blocked from your energy completely. Someone could be having an accident on the road because they wanted you to have an accident or they chose to do some sort of spell work to try to take you out here. Someone could be, um, somebody could have caused somebody's death by doing something to their car, or somebody could have been found dead in a car, and someone's, like, trying to rule it an accident or overdose, but this is someone that did this to someone, that's a side message, that's not for everybody, and also I'm getting, like, somebody really wants to block you from having a car, or causing you issues with your car, that's energetic blockages, they can't do that anymore, you release this person and it's backfiring, they can't hold on to your energy, They've been trying to hold on. Like, I can't make this up. In reverse, they have been trying to hold on, but it's blocking them. You're in your hangman mode. You're reflecting. You're intuitive. Somebody ran out of options to block you or stop you or deceive you. The Six of Cups in reverse could have been dealing with an own mother figure, grandmother, aunt, or family member that was always trying to keep you in this connection of anxiety, fear, or doubt because this person wanted to project to you with mirror spells or food magic. And um, you could be no longer talking to this person. This person could be going through some um, spiritual, uh, something spiritual right now, like a, some sort of spiritual attack or warfare or having dreams, um, losing sleep, health concerns. Everything's backfired. Judgment in reverse. Someone was trying to delay judgment being called. But yeah, this Knight of Wands that's rushing in was dealing with a Queen of Pentacles in reverse. This Knight of Wands, Aries Leo Sage energy, was dealing with a Queen of Pentacles in reverse, and this person could be moving forward, coming towards you, or this person is coming to tell you some sort of truth about this Queen of Pentacles that they know. Somebody was sleeping with someone else. Somebody could have got an STD from this person. And the Leo, the strength card is here. You could be dealing with a Leo. And the Two of Cups is you and your soulmate are going to have a stronger connection, stronger bond. This person couldn't break that. They couldn't stop it here. Okay. Whew, yeah, well, um, my air signs, you guys are very intuitive, you guys are very inclined, you guys can literally read someone's thoughts or energy, or you can feel this person's energy, they have bad intentions, this could be a karmic friend, lover, ex, family member, it could be all these people, it could be also a neighbor that's giving you a hard time or interfering in your life somehow, or lying on you, or deceitful, somebody has a daughter in the situation, someone could be having a daughter, or someone's having a child here, it could be a girl, Okay, somebody could have a daughter that's going through something or a daughter that you need to protect this daughter, okay? This daughter could be spiritually gifted. Mm, spirit for the Gemini Libra Aquarius. Love messages. So you're going to get some sort of love messages from someone that walked away, but this person was a cheater or is a cheater, okay? Or someone that you're dealing with was sending love messages to somebody else. That shit hit the fan you found out. You guys are about to become very wealthy here, um, achieving great money, great success, and abundance. 
connecting with your past life soulmate. Somebody was caught on video. I can't make it up. Somebody got recorded having a same sex relationship or cheating with someone. And this is going viral or this is be, you're, you're hearing about somebody else having the secret uh, love affair. There's a secret baby or somebody getting pregnant unexpectedly, maybe keeping it a secret. Maybe if you guys are uh, pregnant, maybe you're keeping it a secret. Someone here is keeping a secret here of a child or a pregnancy. Somebody in your life and your family was trying to use your info to take you out for insurance money while doing death spells on you. That, that didn't work out because you're still here. Someone could be passing away or someone could be going through some sort of like mental health issues because those entities they sent to take you out, they're, they're taking this person out, they're destroying this person, they're tormenting this person and energy and wow, this is crazy. Air sign, spirit, anything else? Yeah, some of you guys have a cousin that's very shady and jealous of you. This could be the aunt's child if you had an aunt. You know that, you know, you were close to this aunt at one point, but then this aunt started showing her true colors, or maybe you detached. This cousin, this could have been the aunt's child here. Somebody's getting exposed with this third party, okay, relationship, same sex or whatever. Or it could be, you know, it doesn't have to be same sex, but two people are getting caught hooking up and it's going to be on, on video or someone's taking a picture or there's some sort of proof. You're getting good news here. And some someone's mother figure here using information and um, trying to forge signatures to get some sort of insurance claim or money or inheritance, whatever this is, is getting caught up. This female here, new job or business deal, doesn't have to be someone's mother, but I say mother figure because this person has children. Okay, you guys are coming and, and, you know, you guys are reaping rewards. Somebody here is getting a new job opportunity, new business, or you're getting a pay raise. You're going to get a raise at your job because I feel like you guys have been asking for a raise or you deserve it. You work hard. You work harder than most of the coworkers or whatever. This is for someone watching, but you will finally get your raise. When you get your next, next paycheck, you're going to see an increase. You're going to get the raise you've been asking for because this company, they really can't afford to lose you guys, okay? So these are the messages that I'm getting for your reading, my beautiful Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, stepping into your powers, finding out the truth about this karmic or this female or this male in your life. Regardless, father figure came out and mother figures, but you guys are intuitive, stepping into your power, spending more time in nature, seeing the truth and getting the clarity, and you're walking away. It's like choosing yourself first, loving yourself, realizing that everybody around you has some sort of fake mask or facade. Is basically allowing you to manifest what you want because they're they're not attached to your energy or you're not allowing them to come into your space. You're keeping your plans secret. Someone here is not even telling someone that they're having a... Some of you guys could keep it a secret if you find out you're pregnant. For my females, if you found out you're pregnant or you're finding out, keep it to yourself. Somebody wanted you not to have a child. They were doing some sort of womb blockages. So keep that to yourself. Protect this child. This child will be an awakened child. Someone has an awakened child. Or this could be a daughter that you have or someone's having a this daughter. Okay. Thank you so much. If you need a personal reading, reach out to me. Emails down below. Till the next time. Love you guys. Namaste.